Welcome back to another episode of Stay in Your Lane Podcast and YouTube weather. YouTube weather! <laughs> Partly cloudy with a bunch of BS headed our way. What was the DM we got, you got today you told me about? Oh, um, somebody was uh, calling <laughs> you out. <laughs> somebody was calling me out. Somebody was calling you out, but uh, hold on, let me let me go back because let me read the title of this live stream. Oh, it was a live stream? Oh, yeah, it was a live stream. Oh, yeah, it was a live stream. And don't worry, the person that sent it to me said he'll probably delete it anyway, so. If that's who I'm thinking of, he will uh, delete it. He always does. Chilling like a villain with good people. With good peeps? With good people, but I wouldn't <laughs> include him in good people. Oh, my. Uh, so, we're talking about, oh, uh, uh, what's his name? Silent Killer. Okay. I guess, apparently, he goes live, and he, he's done this before, several times in the past, over the years. I remember the first time he done this, he went live calling me out. It was like 9, 9.30. I was on my way home from work. I had no clue the man was live, and I got accused of being some trolls. Uh, you know, maybe so we're doing this again. for the sake <clears throat> of the community and the people that don't really know Silent and don't know mine and Silent in your history... Yeah. Maybe we should backtrack a yeah, little bit like and start three or from four the beginning. Years. Oh, you mean the time he cried for two weeks when you called him a motherfucker? <laughs> oh, yeah. That was back when all he talked mm -hmm. about was, you know, the house fire. Mm hmm Anyways. He's shady, man. He's always shady. Well, you know, and, you know, we can say he's shady all day, but, like, I have proof to back up that shit. I have I receipts to back up that shit. I have, you know, this pattern of behavior that he does when he wants to manipulate people. See, Silent is a lot smarter than people think he is. Mm-hmm. You know? And, you know, let's let's begin how, how you know, we all kind of met each other through Briggs's chats and stuff, whatever. And yeah. he was trying to be like a little social climber. Yeah. Going from one group to the next. Man, he would, he only followed females on Twitter and nobody else. That's all he would follow. That's all he allows on his He was about back panel. when his handle used to be at Long Dong. <laughs> <laughs> no, it was something else before that, but I remember he, okay. he, I noticed he only had females from the YouTube group, you know, in his, on his Twitter. That's all he okay, would Okay, so he with. makes up this lie that you and Kickstand came to one of his live streams and said that, and it, it, this is hard for me to even repeat because... Well, it said something bad about his daughter. Let's just put it that way. Well, I want to go ahead and say what it is because... I don't want you to strike for saying it. Well, Okay. So you guys still be watching. If you want to know what Silent made up, then hit me up in the DMs because I'm telling you, sick. no. If you're a parent, you would never think of your child being victimized in this type of way. Only a sick individual would think something like that to come up with a lie such as that. And he goes and he runs to people that don't like us with this lie. And then he he ended up having to admit it was a lie because there was never a live stream. He never went live. You know, he publicly admitted it was a lie, but he started with what I'm going to say is example one of his pattern of behavior of running to fake bigger YouTubers. Let's, before the fake troll accounts, he ran to Briggs and Tina, remember? Yeah. Crying to them that you guys had trolled him with, you know, stuff about his kid. You know, some of the most triggering things that you can do on the internet is yeah. talk about somebody's child or somebody's dead family member. And he's still so this kid. this was to trigger people and and to upset people and it all was a lie, a publicly admitted lie that he finally admitted to <coughs> because once he figured out that it was impossible for his lie to fit, he had to come off it cuz usually the type of person silent is is he will lie to the death. He will be lying caught red-handed, freak the fuck out. How dare you accuse me of such a thing i would never do such a thing and be dead ass lying to you mm -hmm. okay like getting trolled by his dead dad but i digress because i want to but talk about more that day things i've been the trolls and you've been the trolls and i, and I was the troll that day okay so that's then, what he said that's what he accuses us of i'm just saying okay so then you know after he trolled me for a while he stole some pictures off of my twitter and at this time, he was instigating me. Like, I would ignore this kid till I was blue in the face. Redneck would be bitching at me because he'd be working all day. And I'd be bitching to him that this kid won't leave me the fuck alone. And that he's trolling me and he's fucking with me. And he's like, just fucking ignore it. You know, ignore it and he'll stop. 
And then he finally realized after the kids stole my pictures from my Twitter and used them as a thumbnail. So Redneck goes to him, he tells, he tells you what? They were Googleable images. They told somebody that. I don't know if he told me that because I've never had DMs with him until okay. like the other day. Well, he That's told my first maybe time it ever was me. He told. Maybe it was me. He told that these were Googleable image images. Okay, this was something that one of my children made for my my mother. It was a one of a kind thing that was never Googleable image. wasn't anywhere. But he still lied. I'm not all these trolls. I'm not all these trolls. Until Redneck stepped in to defend me. And fucked with him a little bit. And then finally, because I had him blocked on everything, he had to come to me with his troll account on Twitter, which I still have receipts of, crying to me, <laughs> you know, to make Redneck stop and, you know, like saying, yes, he was these trolls, okay? And this was after hearing how dare I accuse him of lying, how dare I accuse him of making this shit up, how dare I accuse him of being this troll, He's these fucking trolls, okay? Yeah. So so then to me, I'm like, okay, here we go again. When I don't believe silent, he likes to freak the fuck out. He is not above sniffling, crying, bitching, complaining to get people to believe that I'm doing these things to him. You know, he won't tell people about all the diss tracks he made about me sucking his dick and all that shit. He won't mention any of those things. Or how he trolled me. You know, all he wants to mention is his victimized part of it. That I won't leave him alone. Even though I'm hardly even on YouTube. I bring him another video he made that you don't remember. Is He made a cartoon of me and you and you beating my ass. And telling me what to do and all this stuff. Mm. So you ladies out there. <laughs> so anyways. So me and Silent, we kind of make up. We call it a truce. You know, I forgot. He probably did a couple more things, too, that I just cannot... Here, let me look... Let me there, look there's, there, I can bring up tons of stuff. Remember the time he made a troll account, put a video of me on the troll account, then came to me and was like, let's strike the video and get it down. They can't be messing with you like that, redneck. Yes, and, when he privated it. And, <laughs> and then he, he admitted... Okay, because that, that, that YouTube channel still exists. He made a YouTube channel of me and Reddit, me and Redneck. The backdrop is Redneck's Twitter... And it's a picture of me, and because he lost his phone, sold his phone for crack, I don't know what he did with his phone, sold it for gas, who cares? You know, now I have, you know, this channel that he can't take down that I've tried to strike and get down, you know, but can't get rid of it. But he won't admit to that that party. Well, no, he did admit to that. But well, it could he said only he was be sorry. him because he unlisted the video, but I could still see the video. I'm like, no, the, well, you didn't strike the video, and I didn't ask you to strike the video for me. And you just unlisted the video. Cause... And he's admitted to me in DMs that, yes, that was him, and he felt bad about it. And I asked him to take the shit down, and he wouldn't... Um, he said he couldn't take it down because he lost the login credentials to remember it. Remember, didn't he have another Mystery Man account that he was uploading on his regular channel before the Mystery Man account? And I had notifications That's why on he got both. so mad at us <laughs> and started trolling me even harder was because you had busted... I mean, you had already busted someone for being the Mystery Man troll. And then when you when we would call his troll accounts out, he would get so fucking pissed that he would like steal pictures from my Twitter and fuck with us yeah. and shit. Because he had a troll account. He's trying to be Mystery Man again or something is what it was. And he uploaded on his regular channel before he uploaded on the Mystery Man channel within seconds. Let's, let's not forget you comment on a troll channel and he'll he'll message you with his yeah, real Yeah, I'm going to tell that story in just within a second. Within two seconds. Okay, so <laughs> let's go to, let's fast forward to our truce. Allison and me are doing live panels together. She's got an axe to grind with silent them over there for some ways that she was treated, which wasn't acceptable, but, you know, that's between them. So silent makes a troll account of her. Allison smells like piss, okay? That troll account had two subs, me and Allison. <laughs> um... I go and I look in the description box and it has like silence lingo. You know, this is because this one and that one and that tough guy and that tough girl. And I commented. I'm like, silent, if you're trying to act like this isn't you. I forgot exactly what I commented. Yeah. Within seconds, he's in my hangouts saying to me, Jamie, how could you accuse me of such? Like, here we go with the how dare I accuse him of this. And I start to think about it. And I'm like, how the fuck do you know, bro? Like... That thing has like two subs and he literally DM'd me within seconds. 
okay and and i was like he he tells me his favorite excuse well my friend had my sent me this dm <laughs> telling me that you had commented i'm <laughs> like <laughs> and i'm like there's no way it does not work that fast mm -hmm. like there's no way that you would have known this quickly unless that's your fucking account and you were logged into it yeah so then he, then he's, he's, how dare I, you know, I'm supposed to be his friend, you know, he's crying, he's upset over this, he's like, how dare I, and this is like the third time that because I didn't believe what he was trying to sell me, it's how I'm a scumbag because I don't believe the bullshit, okay, so then after that, what happens after that, let me think about it, okay, so I, I don't believe him, no, I, I tell him, well, look, Send me the DM of your homeboy messaging you about this shit and, and block the names out, whatever. Just message me where your homeboy sent you a message telling you that I commented. And he never, how, like, how, why am I asking him to prove it? He don't have to prove it. Now, let's fast forward a couple months when he forgot he was logged into that account. He got on Lisa Lynn's panel and he started talking and everybody's like, I knew that was fucking silent. I knew it was fucking <laughs> silent. And let me tell you, th this is after the, how dare Jamie not believe me? You're supposed to be my friend, blah, 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 blah. Okay, so I'm starting to recognize a real big pattern here. That any time I don't fucking believe this kid, he flips the entire fuck out, or anybody doesn't believe him. He has to convince people of these lies that he tells. You know, after that, it was... What was it after that? Okay, so... The troll account shit. Then he gets caught being the fucking troll account. That's usually how it and, goes. <laughs> and then all of a sudden... Okay, so I'm in Allison Lives one night. And some uh, account pops up. I didn't know who the fuck the account was. And within he's seconds. within seconds. He's DMing me saying that's that you know that's a, a a troll of my dad. Get it out of there. I'm like what? Where? Like I didn't even know his dad's name. Once again, I was accused of that troll too. You weren't even <laughs> on YouTube at the time. I was on YouTube, and I put the proof out there that I was on YouTube. I just wasn't messing around with his ass. Well, anyways, but still. So so me and Allison, we blocked this troll. And I start noticing that the only time this troll around is, is ever around, you know, because sometimes I sit back and I watch and I pay attention and I started to notice that this troll is only around in silence chat. Yeah. And I'm like, well, how come he hasn't fucking blocked this troll oh, yet? Yeah. Like, why isn't this troll blocked? I'm blocked. I can't go in there and say shit. There was one night when we were unblocked. We went in there and his dad troll was in there trolling him. And we, and said, we were talking block shit. It. And we were talking shit. And he blocked me and you first. And but we were like, but you didn't block your father's troll. Why didn't you block that? You know, and, and he wanted so this was badly. Months, ago, months, six, months, eight, and months, 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 and, nine and months right ago. up. And because we wouldn't believe that, he goes running to bigger YouTubers to fight his battles for him. That's when he ran over to Tina's. You know, talking about they troll me with my dead dad, and he sends me what I like to call in YouTube land as non-proof. So Silent literally sends me a picture of screenshots of his notifications of his dad troll commenting on his shit. I said, well, all you have to do is log into daddy, <laughs> comment on your shit, log out of daddy, log back into Silent Killer, SKF, whatever, and take a screenshot. That's this non-proof to me. been around for like almost a year and Off it hasn't and been deleted. It won't, be, it won't delete it. Exactly. He won't block it. Well, Anybody only, else can block shit The only shit time that pops up is when he's trying to get people to believe that you and I are scumbags in doing this. Yeah, it has nothing to do with me. I didn't even know your dad was dead when you DM oh, that night on Instagram. He DM'd me on Instagram, and I told him I was going to do something to him. Because I don't want to give you a strike for threats. But he, what does he do? He goes, run crying to your DMs. That he, I told him I was going to beat him up. Yeah. And then... Uh, you were like, hey, we're having dinner. We've had all day long. We've been we've done legal stuff. We've been to hospitals. We've been doing... We're, we're, it was like at that time, I was going through a really hard time in my real life yeah. and wasn't on YouTube much. And it was, and he knew what I was going was through because I told time. him. It was 11 o'clock his time. And we were eating dinner. We were eating the steak. Just sat down to dinner. Yeah, we just sat down to eat dinner after taking care of the kids all day and doing this and that. Having a busy full day. And he still would not give it up and be like, oh, I'm sorry, guys. I'll talk to y'all later. You know, no, and, and to me, it's irritating because we both, we all know that he's lying about it. So I'm having to be bothered about this bullshit. And, and, and then, and then he doxes me. 
you know, he, he gets information from Tina and them. He goes over to his channel. One of his friends sends me a DM like, hey, Silent fucking just, you know, is calling out members of your family. And I'm like, what? Like, yeah, you're kidding me. Yeah, mentioned some names that there's no way this person knew the names. So I go and I, I call Silent, <laughs> Silent directly and I said, what the fuck is wrong with you? Like, why are you doing this? He's like, well, I, I think Redneck's trolling me and, and, and I'm mad at Redneck. So why the fuck are you bringing That's this to move. me? I mean, if you're mad at me, don't go after Jamie. That's just, it's, and it's always went like that. He's mad at me and he'll, he'll attack you. And it's like, what the fuck, dude? <laughs> there's no reason for any of that. that that's not how you that's not how this works that's not how any of this works then there was a whole time on twitter when he kept trying to get my attention on twitter years ago and you you know we're gonna win a right you didn't even <laughs> i did i met the dude and i put the thing there yeah i put it under there i applied to your tweet dude your fucking tweet is fucking protected i can't see it no matter what you do no, <laughs> i would do actual live shots from my computer showing that they're just not showing up because you got a little <sighs> rent you have a little padlock next to your name so no matter what you do or say nobody can see it <laughs> okay so he has this he has this pattern of behavior where if i don't believe him he flips the entire fuck out yeah and if he wants like somebody to go after somebody he doesn't like, he goes and he, he tries to hook up with bigger YouTubers that may be feuding with that person. He went to Tina about Allison Live. Allison Live had never said a damn word about Tina, didn't say shit about her. And somehow Tina ends up with pictures, which everybody knows Silent gave everybody pictures of it, you know. And you gave them to Abe too and um, Tina. And that was pretty fucked up of you. You know, me and Abe got in a little spat on one of MER streams, and you're in his DMs wanting wanting proof of it. But me and you were supposed to be good, but you, but it's okay for you to go behind my back and cry to fucking motherfuckers and talk about, you know, I troll you with your dad and all this bullshit to try to get people not to like me and to think I'm a scumbag. And then you tell your friends, like, okay, well, you know, I don't talk about her, you know, it, it's... But then he uploaded the highlight reel, and you were blocked, and can't even right. comment on the highlight so, reel. So, so. you, to, to get my attention, you're going to put me in a highlight reel, and then I'm fucking blocked, and you can't even see my comments. Yeah. You know? And, that, and that's another pattern of behavior, being blocked. His first live stream calling me out, like, three or four years ago, like I was blocked. Like when he blocked. did with Ghost that time? I was blocked. <laughs> And then I'll be like, I'll call him out for being blocked. I mean, you can't call somebody out and they're blocked. Then he'll unblock me. So far, me. we don't even fuck with his Then chat. we get blocked again for something in another live stream. Then we'll call. It, he'll call us out again talking shit. And we'll be like, dude, you're, we're blocked in your chat. Why the fuck are you doing this? You know what so, it is? It's it because we don't again. have 10 other accounts like he does. And, and it's like tonight. Uh, he, did, he called me out. But if I go in there, I'm just going to get blocked. And we're going to do the whole cycle all over again. Right. And it's going to be the same thing, because you call him out, and you call him out on his shit, he'll block you. It's like, the last time I was blocked is because his dad was in the chat, and I'm like, yes, your dad, why don't you block I want to give another example of him freaking out um, to, to get people to believe a narrative that's not true, okay? The other day, you know, he, um, when I first met Silent, he was doing videos about his outfits, Oh, yeah. And he was also like, remember when, you know, he did the video where he gave like the homeless guy a dollar? That was like yeah. how many years ago, Jeff? Three or four years ago. I mean, that was a, that was a way back in the day. Okay. Well, we've got receipts for it at somewhere. At the Walmart. Okay. At the Walmart. So he gives Across the street from the square. guy a dollar. So fast forward to probably a few weeks ago, a month ago, he's on Pagel's panel and he's making sure everybody in that chat knows that he donated to Lisa and Pagel. And I'm just thinking to myself, like, this is exactly the type of behavior, like, when he gave the homeless guy a dollar and he had to, like, do a video on it. Because I was always taught, you know, like, when you want to help somebody or you want to donate, you do it in private. You don't yeah. have to make a spectacle the of Bible it. The Bible says you do it in so private and you get rewarded I in mentioned that. Public. And he's like, do you want to know why, Jamie? Do you want to know why? Like, he, like, I could see his face turning red and he's probably about to cry again. And he's like, that was the day my dad died. And I'm like, bitch, no, it wasn't. Like, are you hot? Like, what are you, what are you saying? So, like, he, him and I both, I think, both realize at that moment, like, he's lying his ass off and he knows that I know he's lying. Okay, we got interrupted because my kids were calling. Let's get back to, we were talking about, um, so, so he's on panel and, you know, Jamie, 
do you know why? And he's like, you know, I can imagine his face all red and I'm crying. He's like, that's the day my dad died. And it's like, bitch, no, it wasn't. <laughs> like, that happened like a couple years before that. Yeah. And he's like, no, I mean my friend. And it happened a year before that. I mean, but that's like my point of, of how far this kid will go. I'm sorry he lost his dad. I feel bad about you know, that. And I did it's not too. me trolling And I him. would never troll somebody with their dead relative. I just yeah. would not. I would not troll with the kid shit. I'm sick and tired of it. Like, there's certain things, like, I have certain morals on here, and I know that Silent went crying to some of our mutual friends, what, how many weeks ago? Last week, a week it was before? Last week or a week. So he went crying to somebody. Crying to somebody that, that redneck sat it again, trolling him with his dead dad. And I wasn't. And dead dad popped back up, because that's how much he wants people to not like yeah. you and I. Okay, because, like, today, okay, uh, he, called, he called me out on live stream, I guess, from, you know, when somebody DM'd you. But, but what was I dealing with today? My son. Who's sick? It was sick today. I was cooking dinner, you know, and doing a few other things uh, and my other online stuff that I do, my, my websites. So, you know, it's not like I'm sitting around here all day and I'm, I got Netflix I'm, <laughs> and Hulu. So, I, I mean, I, I mean it, I'm not sitting here pondering on the one person going live trying to call me out. I have... You know, my kids to take care of. I right. can't. I and don't since got time. I found out about this shit, I've been throwing some shade <laughs> on him in some chats. You know, because I'm tired of his shit. I just want him to just like fall in a hole already. I'm, like just now, just when we got interrupted, that the, my phone turned off because my daughter called me. You know, because she needed something. You know, and I and we took care of it. We're not these YouTubers that are on 24 seven, and no hate towards you guys that are on 24 seven. We just don't have time for it anymore. In the beginning, we were on a lot more than we were, but our lives have changed in the last year. Oh, I mean, changed quite a bit drastically. Yeah. You know, I got diagnosed with enclosing spondylitis, and I've been dealing with that. So, like, I don't catch everything that's said. I don't catch who hates who, what you know, all the drama that's going on. I'm not up to speed on it, but I do know that I do yeah. have some personal friends on here that tell me shit. Especially when Silent is fucking crying to them that we're doing bullshit that we're not even doing just because he has an agenda. It, 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 Silent, I don't know what your mental history is. You know, I, I have a theory. You know, <laughs> I do. <laughs> you know, I remember when we were friends and, you know, you had this stream and you were talking about how your dad had thought you had stolen this change so you went digging under the porch to dig up and find all this change to like prove to your dad like that you didn't steal it. And you just have this thing where you don't like people accusing you of lying. And you will sit there and literally like lie to the death, cry, victimize yourself and make yourself sound so pathetic that how it's not you to the point where you're like, how dare somebody accuse you of such and then time and time again, I've caught you in the lies where you've pretty much told me, Jamie, you're supposed to be my friend. How dare you think I'm this way when, bitch, you're that way. You know, you've done these things. How many like, years ago did we hear him say, I'm done with the trolling game. I'm not doing that no more. I, I'm changed. I won't ever do that again. He's changed. He'll never do it again. And then he's trolling Allison lying. Yeah. You know, with a Allison smells like cat piss trying to call us out because we were calling him out over that whole TJ situation. And, you know, I mean, just like the other night, I'm pretty sure that was a troll in Scott's chat. You know, you, you go and you try to, like, talk shit to people that maybe want to be in a relationship or get to know somebody else. You know, and it's like, if you're going to be saying Scott's a scumbag or other people are a scumbag, well, you goddamn right, I'm going to call you a scumbag. Well, he goes and gets involved in people's personal relationships, you know, behind the scenes. And he more than once has this happened. You know, and I don't want to name names. And one was very recent, and I was upset about that he said something to somebody about something. Well, I know that he has some friends that are that are mutual friends with me. I adore Dateline. You know, I don't have any problems with Leo or Karen or any of these girls. You know, and I actually find it more productive to go through them than I do silent, to be honest with you. But at the end of the day, like, you guys don't know him like I know him. You know, I've been around silent. We've rubbed elbows in this community for going on four years now. And every time he's crying about something is somebody else. And 
somebody's doing this to him most of the time it's him doing it to himself because he he likes to be the victim and have people feel sorry for him yeah it's the same cycle over and it's just going to be the same cycle so, didn't you over find some comments over. where he was commenting on a bigger youtuber's channel you know uh th this guy gun is trolling me with my dad's dead daddy oh and yeah he shit. was blaming gun for the for the dad troll at one point and uh and this was like not even that long ago after he supposedly was, made up with gun it, it may not even a video it may have been like it was an article it was a news article but it, it was, was a, a bigger news youtuber a, i think it had to do with onision something something to that extent and somebody had a news article and he was in the comments, comments. Of, yes. of the article that wasn't even we, we, this wasn't even on youtube yeah we were just like yeah <laughs> it was we a were, blog post right, or something yeah we were like because we were kind of thinking about doing a stream on that at one point the onision yeah shit. for some reason i i ran across it and i was going through the comments on this thing i'm like how the hell is this is silent killer. And I'm and then you send it to me and I'm like, I thought they made up like a month ago. It was like kumbaya, my lord, like peaceful, <coughs> you know, and, and that's just the, how he likes to victimize himself. And I know that, you know, the, the girls over there, they want to be protective over him. But but stay in your lane on this. Like, I have legitimate reasons why I don't like this kid. He he acts snaky like he doesn't bring me up when he does. He doesn't bring up redneck, but he does. You know, he, and he might he not be doing it to up. you guys, but he's crying to other people about us. He is. I actually enjoyed his magnet fishing stuff and his metal detecting stuff. I thought that was kind of cool. I thought he had a niche he was going to go for, but I he think won't when stay he's just being it. himself and he's not trying to, like, pretend he's not in the drama when he's really in the drama. Yeah. You know, or just, like, stirring shit up with people or trying to pit people against each other. Yeah. Or just like low key trolling. I call it low key because it's like he's not gonna own that he's doing it, but he's gonna do it. We're singing about kissing Prince. Yeah, <laughs> kissing Prince. I mean, you know. Took the words right out of my mouth. And just leave Missy alone. Like you might have made one video for her, but like don't throw that shit up in her face. You know, she's like trying to. She she tries to be nice to everybody. You know, and yeah. don't don't put her in a bad situation. I don't know anybody in his camp, but I mean, they don't realize the whole history between all of us from back in the day. They don't realize all that. And 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 that we just touched the iceberg here. There's so much shit that has oh, gone yeah. on. Oh yeah, Jerry just slightly scratched the surface. There's way more. You know, more like crap. when he was like begging on shoot the shits panel for Christmas money for being a single dad when he wasn't a single dad. Yeah. It... When he was talking shit on Savage. Saying that she attempted murdered somebody. Yeah, and that she should be in prison for the rest of her life for being murdered. And then making videos dancing around with an AK-47 and videos of nothing of nothing but green bud all over the place. But then he wants to dox me and go over sit in a in a camp where they're doxing me daily and talk shit with them and talk shit on me and cry about how we're trolling him with his dead daddy. You know? I'm not trolling you. I'm not trolling you, Silent. If you're listening, I am not trolling you. It ain't me. I've told you that a thousand fucking times. It, and Four years ago, me. I told you it wasn't me, and it's still not me. I'm not messing with you. And, and okay, and let me make this point today. So, so you send me your DMs of what he said to you. He said, <laughs> what, let's, let's clarify what every means. That's a plural word, correct? Yeah. So when he's saying I'm following him to every video he comments on and leaving messages... That was one video. That was DM Rage Scott's video. I left you some comments under one video. So when you DM him trying to be shady and be like, she comments everywhere I go. He said you were messaging okay. him and stuff. And he messaged me. You were sitting I know. I was me. sitting in the car with you when you pulled up the, out the phone and go, oh, look, I got messages from Silent. The last time I called Silent was the night that his friend came to me and said uh, he, in the same he car. doxed you and we we had just pulled into my driveway and i said what and i looked at my messages and i'm like thank you so much for telling me that and i called your ass up and said why the fuck are you doing this to me right now and you said because you were pissed at redneck because we're trolling you with your dead dad that only you see that only comments under your videos that only follows you around that's never blocked in your chats that that is sketchy as fuck. <laughs> the only people that see that is his notifications when he pulls up his notifications. That's yeah, the only time from, he gets seen. when he switches accounts. Yeah, he uh, he'll be live and like, look, they're doing it right now. See, and he it's just like I've seen him done it a thousand times over. That's one of his little gimmicks. It's called failed troll school, man. It's called <laughs> failed trolling. Stop okay? trolling. Silent. Go back Stop to making trolling. videos about your outfits. 
And your two palm well, he's chain. Got a good niche. He's got the metal detector and he's got the magnet fish. And I mean, he, he he's got some great magnets. He needs to he needs to work with that. You know. Just leave us alone. We if you don't want me talking shit and bringing up um, history, number one, don't try to rewrite history. Don't try to start a fight between me and Redneck, insinuating that I'm calling you and messaging you and and commenting under your shit all the time. Don't go crying to our mutual friends that I'm doing shit to you that I'm not fucking doing. And Let's yes, start I, with that. Yes, I have commented on your video saying crap to you, and I can't say out loud on the on this uh, podcast, but I did. I mean. <laughs> Straight up, and I and I, what I told you earlier on, on, on the DMs when you DM me, that's the first time I've ever been in DMs with him. I think. Yeah, but ever how many times years. do we have to hear that he's like stirring up shit, saying that we're trolling him? Yeah. When we're too busy to be fucking trolling anybody. Yeah, it's it's not us, man. We try to tell you that a thousand times over, and you. you it's and listen. you know what it is? It's because I think it's him. It bothers him so bad that I won't fucking. Take the bait and just be like, okay, Silent, I believe you. Well, I believe it's him because the, the troll never gets blocked. The troll's still here. After nine months, the troll is still here. Jeff, it's like <laughs> the time that he he messaged me. As soon as I commented on that cat piss channel, within seconds, and I'm like, hold the fuck up. This is funny. <laughs> How the fuck does he know? Yeah. There's only one way he could have known if the channel was his. So I, I even I even like begged him, like, please give me something to make me think it's not you because there's no way you would have found out that fast because it was literally within seconds. And I went back with my phone and, and screenshotted and, and recorded all of this shit so that way I don't look crazy. And, and I even said, show me where your boy DM'd you that I commented and just block out the name, block out the number, whatever. Just show me that. And it was how dare I even think that of him. And this is an account you got caught with. When you went on Lisa's talking and you straight got busted because you forgot you was under the troll account. Mm -hmm. Okay? And that was when uh, Mills was like, Silent, what the fuck? You've <laughs> denied having this account for how many months now? Yeah. And everybody knew it was you, tough guy, with this and one his, and that one. His new little group over there, they'll find out too. They'll see sooner or later. Well, I think Missy's starting to find out, and she's a nice girl, and I don't want to see her getting... It don't take much. Just sit around and watch and pay attention. It don't take much to figure it out. He'll do the same stuff over and over Right, and over. wait until there's no drama, or wait until one of you guys getting a little tiff. And next thing you know, he's getting trolled and he's crying to your friends about you saying how fucked up you are. And then people will be like, oh, that Jamie and Redneck, they were right. Yeah. You know how many times he's went live calling me out and I've been blocked? You know how many times that has happened? Like, I can't <laughs> even because it's happened to me too. And then we call him out for not being blocked and then we'll be unblocked and go, you're not blocked. Well, it's like how he and supposedly it, doesn't have any cycle. problems with me so much that he can do a highlight reel on me and be like, well, I didn't have any problems with Jimmy. Then how the fuck am I blocked yes. and not able to comment, Silent bitch? ain't blocked on my channel. Silent ain't blocked on your channel. And if we go live talking smack about you or saying stuff about you, then you ain't blocked. Tina ain't blocked. Marky Mark ain't blocked. None of Boss Up is blocked. They're all... It's, but it doesn't go the other way around. I mean... Yeah, so it's pointless to call people out. And if you do it, maybe put my name in the title. Like... Or something because I'm not sitting here watching every and that's another thing if I'm watching a stream I'm in there maybe 10 minutes tops like I don't know everybody that has heat with everybody else every fucking problem everybody has with each other I've really not kept up with the drama community much I really have not you know I know that shit with cool Nicole really fucking bothers me I don't fucking like that shit at all yeah you know? I wish she was not the way she was and the way her her situation is because it would be easier to go meet up just saying just well my saying. heart goes out to Pagel and Lisa I think Pagel really did try to help her yeah and it backfired on guy, her man Pagel will help just about anybody out but don't stab me in the back you know he's a good dude yeah and I, I feel bad that you know like he's having to deal with this shit and doesn't know what the fuck to do like should he you know take it legal like what's it going to take to get this person to stop i mean he he really did try to do sometimes when you do good deeds you know they don't go unpunished sometimes shit happens when you try to do good and i think he really was trying to get her to leave people the fuck alone 
and it backfired on him. And, you know, I mean, you can't fault him for trying. Mm -hmm. And the shit that Cool Nicole's doing, I will keep reporting her Twitters. If she wants to fucking keep bringing kids up, you know, I think that as a community, we should all come together and just ignore the fuck out of that girl. Yeah, she don't deserve any attention. Because, I, I mean, we live in her town, but her parents aren't going to do shit about it. Mm -hmm. No, like, unless somebody that is a guardian of her decides to fucking put the smack down on her, or her, her internet gets taken away, or somebody finally legally does something to shut her the fuck up, you know, there's nothing we can do. But, like, manipulating her to go against people's enemies, I think it's totally wrong if that's what's happening. I don't know that's what's happening. But if it is, that's fucked up. Mm hmm Truly. I think it's time we end this and get on out of here because I got to get some rest and watch some Netflix. I know. I'm in so much pain. I just want to, like, go to bed soon. I know. Well, y'all guys have a good week out.